you are all busy preparing for your 10th standard board examination so to ease out your tension we have brought for you an innovative plan a m f m that is a move towards fantastic marks let us see your scheduling for english we are going to provide you smart tips for preparation here is a weekly plan for how to study english in the next few days for which you have to prepare six lessons two poems one rapid reader three grammar topics three writing skills every week students you have to follow this plan every week now let us see for prose section there are two seen passages which are of 20 marks you have to complete in 30 minutes here how to prepare prose section of six lessons per week for which go through the activities like match the following complete the web true or false based on the lesson read all the pr questions from the notes at least twice by heart glossary as well as meanings of difficult words which are marked in the textbook try to write three pr questions in 12 minutes at a time now after prose let us see what exactly is there for poetry section poetry section carries 10 marks you should complete these two questions in 20 minutes how to prepare two poems per week here you have to go through all the figures of speech marked in the poem focus on the rhyming words as well as the rhyme scheme go through the knowledge kit and the summary from the notes read the content based questions and pr questions three times thoroughly try to write two pr questions in 8 minutes at a time my students you have to understand that these content based questions and pr questions are very important for poetry section now let us see what is there for rapid reading section rapid reading section carries 5 marks you should complete in 10 minutes here you get one comprehension passage so how to prepare one rapid reader per week read the lesson thoroughly to know the plot learn the meanings of all the difficult words read the knowledge kit which is given in the notes thrice to understand the plot properly read content based questions and pr questions from notes thrice in a week practice one content based question and one pr question in 8 minutes again my students you have to follow this entire plan so that you will get proper practice for writing pr questions and content based questions now let us go ahead for grammar how to practice grammar solve five sentences of the following topics from practice exercises given in the class or from notes direct and indirect speech transformation of sentences change the voice auxiliaries simple compound complex while practicing the sentences from these topics try to apply the rules given in the theory go through grammar activities given in the lessons let us see for the next section writing skills how to practice writing skills the most creative part students 
should practice three writing skills per week, emphasizing on the following topics like information transfer, report writing, expansion of ideas, speech writing. Students should make a habit of applying the proverbs and quotations in the writing skills such as report writing, expansion of ideas, speech writing. This entire plan you have to practice thoroughly to enable the best marks in writing skills. For the betterment of grammar and writing skills, students should go through all the papers solved by them at least once in 15 days. So that whatever mistakes which you have made in the earlier paper, you would reduce it for the final exam and you would improvise yourself for grammar and writing skills. Now, we would move on to the LDR that is last day revision. What you would do? Read the PR questions of prose, poetry and rapid reader. Activities which are solved in the textbook can be viewed for better understanding. Revise the glossary from all the lessons and poems. Read how the phrases, idioms are used in sentences. Revise the format of each writing skill. Read at least two examples of writing skills of each type. Ensure you have covered all the areas and you are very much prepared to write the paper. The most important thing is be very very positive. Now let us see time management. Question number 1a and b. There are two seal passages of 20 marks. You should complete in 15 minutes each. Question number 2a and b. There are two unseen passages of 20 marks. You should complete in 15 minutes each. Question number 3a and b. There are two seal poems of 10 marks. You should complete in 10 minutes each. Question number 4 is a rapid reading section which is of 5 marks. You should complete in 10 minutes. Question number 5a is formal or informal letter which is of 5 marks. You should complete in 15 minutes. Question number 5b is either a report writing or dialogue writing which is of 5 marks. You should complete in 15 minutes. Question number 6a is information transfer which is of 5 marks. You should complete in 15 minutes. Question number 6b is either view or counter view or speech writing which is of 5 marks. You should complete in 15 minutes. Question number 7a is expansion of ideas or story writing which is of 5 marks. You should complete in 15 minutes. Time which remains for checking the paper is 15 minutes. Now, in this way, you can write your 80 marks paper in 3 hours. Now, let us see the time management entirely. This is your time management. Here, you can complete the paper in this way. Now, let us see there are things to remember while writing the paper. Follow the format of the writing skill. Make sure that a title is provided. Use simple, short but crisp sentences. Handwriting should be legible. Work on presentation. 
avoid spelling mistakes. Consider the length and allotted time. In this way, you will definitely secure the marks. Go for it. Grab it. Wish you good luck.